Hey guys, welcome to a brand new episode of Harry Potter Wizards Unite. Today we are talking about the trip to Indiana. It is finally happening in less than 48 hours. I will be touching down in Indiana. Get there for about 4 o'clock p.m. Uh, US time and... Then I'll be making way to the Airbnb where I'm staying with some other YouTubers and I will be settling down. Don't know if I'm going to go out Friday night. Going to see how things are when I get there. Got to kind of play by ear based on what my body is saying. Right now, my leg has healed and therefore I should be able to walk without a crutch. That would be good. because It's not as um, nerve painy anymore. But I think I've been playing Fortress Battles too much to prepare. And I've got a, a like nerve pain all down my arm. So hopefully some of that will will leave me by the time I get there. Um, yeah, so we'll see. There's going to be loads of meet up, loads of things planned. Uh, definitely going to be meeting a lot of YouTubers there that I've been talking to for like two years almost. Um, we're going to be completing the Dragon Challenge. So there is going to be a global challenge event where you know we have to catch 150,000 dragons, and that will unlock bonuses for the rest of the world and for ourselves so port keys put me to get dragon eggs we now have the page for oddities where we can see the dragons now chinese fall fireball antipodian opalia peruvian viper tooth did i say peruvian viper tooth no peruvian viper tooth and commonwealth green we also have the eggs which will be locked through portmanteaus 12 so we're going to be getting through a lot of port keys with those 1k eggs. And they will be appearable on the map so you are able to distinguish what's a dragon port key and what's a normal port key. Which I'm so happy about because that was going to be really important. Otherwise you'd, 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 you know, through the event we'd be walking off loads of other eggs that we don't really want to because we'll have plenty of time for that. We also have a brand new addition to Hogwarts School which I think only recently dropped. That is the, the previous staircase. So we've got some picture frames. These will be all the house uh the head of houses uh not head of houses the the creators of the house <laughs> the term for them we've got godric gryffindor salazar slytherin rowena ravenclaw and uh sure the hufflepuff one H helena hufflepuff <laughs> and we have a wild boar statue that i have already encountered apparently i have not i have I have not encountered that yet so don't know what that's about oh no 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 it's what? It said that when Thor found a seeking location, our own Ravenclaw had a vision of a warty hog that guided her to a cliff overlooking the lake. Thus, Hogwarts School of Witchcraft Wizardry found it as its name. Oh. Well, goddamn. <laughs> I did not know that. Hog. Hog. Warts. Where did the warts bit come from? It, it was a warty hog. It was a, it was a, oh, it was a warty hog. <laughs> My memory is so bad. I didn't even remember that. I just read the word warty hog. Damn. I didn't know that. That's a nice little interesting fact. Maybe they just gave that as a little a little treat. Uh, none of those which we'll be able to take pictures of. <laughs> Not many we'll be able to take pictures of. I've, I've, I've almost got Percival Graves in. I thought that was unlockable. We've definitely got to get Fire Ends for... We've got to get McGonagall for the trip. Sorting Hat is going to be happening, right? So there's going to be loads of AR opportunities going to be good um but i just want to say a massive thank you to everybody who has supported me to be able to go on this trip all the donations 350 pound in the end was the donation total and that was massive that's helped pay for half my flights which meant i can afford the other half which by the way has been paid for pretty much by the youtube ad revenue for last month so even if you didn't donate just by viewing and watching my videos you have helped out um there was an ad revenue which is 120 quid that's paid for like half my accommodation so i'm only really gonna have to pay for half my accommodation and half and and just my money for, for being out there travel insurance and whatnot uh massive thanks to uh Makusa, who actually was so kind enough to she ordered she, she managed to get entry ticket entries which i haven't had an invitation yet so they are clearly prioritized but Makusa youtube um she bought my ticket and I offered to pay for it, but she kindly refused <laughs> my money and, and was just like, you know what, I, I, my treat, you're traveling all the way. So a massive thank you to her because all of you have made this trip available, affordable and possible. Um, and I'm so excited. It's going to be so good to meet some of the YouTubers that haven't spoken, haven't met. And the only YouTuber I've ever met is, is with the news. 
Um, and I saw him once when he came to the UK and we met up briefly at an expo that we, we were both at. Uh, it happened to be it was in Birmingham. So I went to meet him there. And the rest of the people, like over 20 YouTubers, I haven't met. Um, so it's kind of like get nervous, excited, like more excited. Because I'm not too socially anxious a person, so that like, it's, I'm just more going to be like excited to see them. Um, it'll be really good. So yeah, really looking forward to that. Looking forward to getting engaged in the festivities. Looking forward to recording some good, hopefully good content. That when I edit it, I want to make, I want to really edit it and put some really good effort into it uh, for you guys. So I'm not decided whether it's going to be a, you know, I edit there. Or I edit when I get back home. I'm taking my laptop either way. I'm just going to play it by ear, see how I feel, whether I have enough energy by the end of the day to do so. And if I don't, I will probably be live streaming depending on what my uh, signal is like out there because I know I switched to AT and T, but I think I only get 3G rather than 4G. I'm going to see on Friday how good that is. If it's not good enough, I'm going to have to go out and, and buy an AT and T package unlimited data package we'll, we'll see we'll see a lot of a lot of things to figure out when i get there but rest assured when i get back at least by the time i get back this content will be will be ready to to edit and put out for you guys so hopefully you're as excited as i am for seeing it to those of you who can't go there i will do my best to to give it a good show okay well that's all for this one just wanted to give a little brief message on some of the updates and um what we're going to be uh, well, just thank you for, for for helping support me all along the way. Uh, with those those of you who have been here me since 2016, 2015, and those who've been through Hogwarts Mystery and through Wizards Unite, thank you. Okay, all well, for this one. Hopefully, see you guys soon in the future. Maybe if you are in, actually going. I know a couple of people who have who are actually going. But if not, I'll see you guys in the next video. That's all for this one. See you guys soon.